¿Cómo está, abuelo? ¿Qué tal, Caterina? <laughs> that was some academic decathlon today. You crushed it. If I'd crushed it, I would have come in first place. I figured you'd be a little down about that. I whipped up a little something to celebrate your ribbon. I don't deserve cake. Cake is for winners. You are a winner. There were a hundred kids in that decathlon, and you beat 98 of them. But I wanted to beat 99. I was so sure about this contest, Abuelo. I walked in there really thinking I was the best. Well, you're the best within a mile radius right now. Quick, what's the square root of 289? 17. Capital of Zambia? Lusaka. Chemical symbol for baking soda? NaHCO3. <laughs> you see? No one around here is a match for you. But I still wasn't good enough. Kira Patel still edged me out on the spelling section. I can't believe I forgot there's only one F in aficionado. Misspelling one word doesn't determine how good you are. Author of the Canterbury Tales. Jeffrey Chaucer. I just work so hard on this stuff, all the time. I never leave my room until I know every answer. Everyone at school knows I'm the best. And if I'm not the best, what's special about me at all? Okay, Miha, time to take a minute to breathe. There are so many things that make you special that don't come out of a book. The book stuff is my whole identity. If I fail, it's like I'm not myself anymore. Contests and ribbons don't determine your identity. God does. Don't you remember what the Bible says about who you are? It says you're made in God's image. Genesis 127. And that you're fearfully and wonderfully made. Psalm 139, 14. Exactly. Even if you have to forfeit every ribbon and trophy on our shelf, you're still made in God's image. And if God loves you that much, then you should try to follow his example. But isn't it important to make something of myself? To achieve big things? Of course it's important that you work hard and use your life to do good things in the world. But before any of that even begins, you're special. Those things that you do don't define you. God does. That's your identity. You're saying I should be happy with second place. I'm saying you should give yourself a break once in a while. I... <sighs> okay. Thanks, Abuelo. Have some more cake.